Hey everyone, imagine I have a project and I noticed when, when I run Cypress, sometimes it fails tests, sometimes it doesn't fail a test. So in this case, it seems like in app spec, some of the tests have failed. So how can we confirm that this test is flaky or it has a problem or the app has a problem? Well, we need to run it in isolation a couple times just to confirm to see what's going on. This running in isolation means burning the test, right? Well, I could modify the spec file and add that only and then run just that spec. Or I can use my plugin called Cypress Grep to run a particular test by title or by a tag in isolation. And I just added a feature to burn a test, to run it multiple times in a row. To install Cypress Grep, cm Cypress install is pretty simple. You do npm install or yarn, and then you just add that plugin to your support file. In this project, I already installed it. So all I have to do is use it. So what's the test I want to run? Should allow me to add to do items. I can select the whole title or just part of a title to match the test. I can do npx Cypress run. I can limit myself to just this particular spec file and I can pass what I want to grab for using environment variables that the plugin can read. And I'll add one more parameter burn. So Cypress grab will find a test by title and only run that test. And then by looking at parameter burn, it will execute that test that number of times in the row. Cypress grab is marking every other test as pending, so they're not running, and the matching test is running. And notice how it adds a counter. Because we said burn to 10, it says burning one of 10, burning two of 10, and so on. Great. So this test, even if it's flaky, is not terrible, right? It passed 10 times in a row. So maybe we can burn some other test or look at replication code. But by using Cypress Grab, you can selectively run a test or run it multiple, multiple times in a row to make sure it really works.